Hey guys, welcome once again to Coco TV, the sports channel, the winning channel. This is the sports betting channel you can ever have, or you can ever have. Because this channel, I give you strategies that you can win your sports betting. There are other channels who, who, who just post the games, but they will not give you the strategies of how to win. My strategies, I take a lot of time before I bring out the strategy. And there's this strategy, which is the handicap method. People are still commenting that they don't understand how this thing works. Yes, um, maybe you will not understand it because the term may be complex for you, but it's very easy. So I'm going to explain it step by step from one to the end. So make sure to watch this video to the end. And share this video, please, my followers, share this video for me so that it will save people from losing. Because this is one of the methods that works 100% if you know how to use this method. So if you are new to this channel and you haven't subscribed, do that by subscribing and hit on the notification bell to receive simple updates and notifications whenever I release and post a video like this. Okay, so and then like the video for me because the more you also like, the more YouTube also um, recommend my videos. And then um, if you want to join a WhatsApp group, just check the description section and join. And you can also join my Telegram group from the description below. I said handicap, it simply means um, giving advanced goals for a team. So let's say um, Liverpool and Manchester United is playing today, or they are playing today. And I go for handicap 3 for Liverpool. That means I give Liverpool advanced goals of 3. So whenever they play to 0 0 draw, or they play draw, just goalless or 1 1 2 2 3 3 4 4, any goals that happens between that um, range. I get my win because I have already given Liverpool 3-0, 3 goals. That means Liverpool scores 3-0. Okay, but um, if Manu, if Manu scores Liverpool, let's say 2-1, 2 the scores will come, become 4-1, okay? Or 4-2 rather. Yeah, the scores becomes 4-2 because Liverpool is already having 3 goals at advanced. So when Manchester United has scored them 2, okay? And if Manu score them 2-0, the score becomes 3-2, okay, because I've given um, Liverpool advanced goals of, I mean, 3, okay. But if Liverpool plays 3, Manchester United scores Liverpool 3-0, three, three the bet will spoil because it, it has become um, goalless, that means 0-0, zero, zero, okay, that means 0-0, zero, zero. that means they have equal them. I give them 3 goals in advance and Manchester United has scored a 3, they, they have equal them. But you can then have options that you can also go like um, you can go three for Liverpool or and then you go into the method which is exactly three goals. That means let's uh, say Manchester United will be able to score the three and equal them. They have they also have that type of prediction then, but I don't normally go for that. What I do is I go at goals. So let's also take um, uh, let's let me continue with this one for like. When Liverpool, uh, if Man City scores Liverpool, um, Manchester United scores Liverpool 3, 3, and Liverpool also scores them 1, let's say 3-1, the score becomes 4-3, okay? If they score 3-2, the score becomes 5-3, in that order. So, I hope you now, you, are, you now understand what I am trying to tell you here. And also, let me take another thing here. Let's say, let me take Crystal Palace and Southampton. I give Southampton a handicap goes of three, okay. And Crystal Palace scores them. I mean, one zero. I have a two goals advantage, okay. At the same time, when they score them two zero, I have one goal advantage. But when they play three three, the bet scores, okay. It scores because I went, I, I went for three goals margin. I went for the for Southampton to be leading by goals. So for you to win, if you go handicap, for you to win, the team that you win the handicap for must be leading by a single goal, okay? That team must be leading by a single goal before you can win uh, your bet, okay? So Southampton must be leading. Even if they score three, three, Southampton must score one goal. Add one goal to the three goals that I give them for me to win my bet, okay? That's the only thing that can spoil it if they equal it or they score it. So I went for Saddam team to, to score three goals. And uh, unfortunately, Crystal Palace was able to score about 
five goals or four goals without Southampton scoring. Okay, that means when Southampton lose, I lose the bet. But if Southampton draw or they win, I still um, win. And even I give them three handicap of three. Even if they lose by one goal margin, I still win. If I give them handicap of two and they lose by one goal margin, right, I still win. But if I give handicap of um, one and they lose by one goal margin, okay, I lose because it becomes equal. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is and how to use this to when your predictions is like always use a smaller team against a bigger team you can check one of my videos which is um how i hacked between that was my first video i did about sports betting that was the strategy i was using because i was losing a lot and i came out with that strategy i tried it and it worked i chose 20 teams i was able to choose 20 teams and everything settled i did it i did it over 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 and again and it was working that's why i posted that video and that video is still there you can go and watch that video okay what i did was i choose the bigger team against the smaller team and i when the bigger team the other team is the bigger team i choose them when they are playing at home okay you see betting is something that you need it's a business so you don't need to invest the rules because when you invest your money you need to get it back so that the next time you can also use it to reinvest and make extra money okay you don't need to be losing like that so what you have to do is just take your time be patience when you go there select the team the bigger teams playing at home but my let me remind you this when the big team that's playing at home they don't have the strength yes if they are they don't have four then you don't choose them now let me choose liverpool you see liverpool they don't have four yeah now the big teams like the smaller team can score them anyhow okay you see they can score them anyhow like that so don't choose a team like liverpool for now but if they become strong you can choose them but choose team like manchester united arsenal uh, man city and then the other clubs that you know that they are strong and sometimes uh, chelsea too i think they are strong they only play draw 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 okay you can go for them handicap or go handicap of two that is the safest way you will find the odds to be small yeah the odds will be small you may not get what you want but if you get from 1.5 or to 2 or stick it and relax even if it takes you two weeks to win it stick it and relax because money every small money is a money just go and steal one dollar they'll beat you and they'll tarnish your image so this is how to use this one to predict your bet. So follow me for more and daily I'll be posting sports tips from time to time. So just follow me. If I start posting, then um, you can also be getting it. So thank you for watching and share these videos for me.